All right, so this is part of the show where we're gonna show you around like um, how the creative does his work and what he does. Um, luckily, we're minimalist right now, so it's gonna be quick. But go pretty, ahead, we're gonna be pretty quick, bro. Yeah, I don't go really got show us. I ain't got a whole studio set this up right now. This is a studio right here. This is where we, you know, what I'm saying this is where the magic goes down. You know, a lot of your favorite joints, right here. Simple, you know. All you need is a little. You get the mic, you know what I'm saying. You got the Mac interface and we good bro we can make classics so that's, that's all it. you need that's all that's you need all you bro need, right? like it's just the mic i'll take so i can't mix so i'll take it to my one of my homies and have him mix it you know go in the actual studio and like get it you okay know? so you just, I'll just you i'll just, just lay it down tracks. yeah okay you know? and i got good enough acoustics all right so you record you sit right here in this yeah. chair you know what i'm saying get the them the lights you know everyone's hating on my you know what I'm saying on the on the phone lights, you know. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. You know, so I, I set the mood a little bit. Hell yeah. You know, when it's not you know daylight. Like I said, I like rapping at night. So go yeah. ahead and sit down and like show us show you us what it see looks that? like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so bam. Oh. Usually I got you know a little cat running around and shit fucking me up, but so is there a reason why you kind of like push like in the, to corner? the corner? Yeah, I like being like kind of. Maybe it's the booth feeling. I don't know. Like, oh, I feel I like you. I'm not wide out in the open. Like I like feeling kind of like that. Yeah. Maybe it's the kid in me. You know, I like when you, you want to put up tents and shit. Yeah, like, it's I'll like close it's it almost comfortable, yeah. right? I got you. Yeah. yeah so why do you why do you sit down to rap? That's a good question. I don't know. I think I just started always, doing it when yeah. I got my mic. Mm -hmm. Then it was just easier, so I didn't have to rap, rap, rap. Right. Back to you know, so I can just I can do this right here. Because I, I have my shit in my closet. And like I said, a lot of my shit be like chill, so I don't really. But I know how to like, I'm comfortable enough with my voice that if I need to like have a high energy verse, yeah. I can just do that shit easy. You know what I'm saying? I can I just hop right into it. You know yeah. what I mean? Like, yeah. Is there a reason why you don't mix and master your own stuff or mix your own stuff? I just never cared to learn. Like okay. I'd rather pay somebody and know that's going to be top quality. Yeah. You know, than like try to fuck with that learning curve. You go with the same person every time? Nah. <clears throat> I got two main dudes I use. One is uh, Donnie Domino. Okay. And one is uh, OZ. And what, how yeah. come you, you, you switch, do the, are they different, like how they yeah. do it? Donnie's more like a, he's a, well, Ozzy's an artist too, Ozzy makes beats and, mm -hmm. and shit too, but like, Donnie's more of a, he calls his place the, the dojo, so right. like he likes to, like it's a space, like where you come in and talk and just about random shit sometime, and like, mm -hmm. he also is an artist himself, so he'll like, he'll add shit on it, you know, yeah. like we have that relationship where I'll let him like, he like he might add a little harmony back here or or help himself. Yeah. Oh, okay. Hell so yeah. like sometimes I'll like do full projects with him because I want that whole like experience. Yeah. But Oz like his sound is like always crisp. Like yeah. it's gonna slap. So Hell and yeah. he does it hella quick. Hell yeah. Like he's real quick with his work. Damn. That's so dope. yeah, it just depends. It depends yeah. on who I'm working with because sometimes they'll prefer like an OZ sound over a Donnie and yeah. So it just depends. But like for Pat Ron shit, like we worked with a. Uh, um, the homie AK, okay. for, he did like, he mixed like four of the tracks and then Donnie mixed one and OZ mixed one. Cool. All right, so that's been uh, this little segment of this interview, seeing the space, seeing how Coach Tev can get greatness out of this little space right, right here. here. You don't need, you a, don't lot need a lot to do a lot. So, so no excuses. Yeah. That's the only thing niggas need no to know. No excuses. You don't need to have no excuses, well, what, do, what do we say? Shut up, up and rap? Right. Shut the fuck up and rap. Shut the fuck up and rap. That's the hey. next version. Shut the fuck <laughs> up and rap. <laughs> All right, so this has been uh, another episode of Stop Scrolling TV uh, with special guests Coach Tev and Pat Ron. Um, yeah, check, out, check us out on the next one. Like, comment, subscribe, and all that shit. We'll be back next time. Yes, sir.